when you're in Google Classroom and you're in your teacher's class, you're going to see the assignments in the stream, but you can also go to Classwork. So stream is in the bottom left on the iPad, top left on a Chromebook, and in the bottom you'll see Classwork. This is where I'm going to see due dates and different things posted. If you look, I was working on Tuesday's work for art. I could open up assigned in the bottom right. And I can see that I can um, to go ahead and work on the assignment or I can turn it in. I can also add a private comment to my teacher where I can tell them something about this assignment so that they know that I had to take a screenshot or I had to do something so that they know. When I'm ready to turn in, I'm going to click turn in and then turn in again. It's going to then say that the assignment has been turned in and then I can unsubmit it if I want to to make any changes. If I go back out of the assignment and close that, when I go back in, you'll see instead of assigned in the bottom right, it's going to say turned in. After a few days, I might want to go back into Google Classroom and check on that assignment. So I'm going to go into Google Classroom and go into the class. I'm going to click Classwork, which is in the bottom middle. If you notice, any assignment that I've turned in is grayed out. So that's another good indication that it's been turned in. I'm going to click on that work that I turned in earlier. At the bottom right, instead of a sign or turned in, I'm now going to see a grade. If I click on that grade, I'm also going to be able to see it in the top right, but I might also be able to see some comments that the teacher left if I click on my actual doc. So if I click on the doc, remember to go into your doc you need to do the square with the arrow. So I'm going to go there and that's going to take me to my Google Docs. And then to look at the comments, if you look at the little feature up by the little person to add people, it looks like a dialog box. If you go ahead and click on that, you're going to see what the teacher wrote and she wrote great organizational skills. If you want to write any private comments back to your teacher about your grade, to ask any questions, you can just click here, click private comment, add a private comment, and then you may go ahead and say thank you and send it to them. And then you'll be able to see that you have sent a comment to them and what it says.